Hi, Good Life Guy here. Thanks for stopping by and checking out some of the videos. I wish you could be here. Of course, oftentimes I say that. We're in the Willamette Valley, and we're at Willamette Valley Vineyards, by the way. I wish you could see the view behind the camera. It's magnificent. With me today, my good friend Don Crank, winemaker here at Willamette Valley Vineyards. Thanks for the time, Don. Sure. Hi. Thanks, Guy. I appreciate you coming by. Pour me some of that. I got some 2009 Willamette Valley Vineyards Pinot Gris. Uh, we're putting here in the glass. Um, one of the reasons I love this yeah. wine is uh, it's got a wonderful bright blade of acidity with this wonderful apple and, cr and crisp uh, pear type of nuances. Um, but um, maybe that's not, not, not the most, the, the greatest thing about the wine is uh, probably the texture. So we, we spend a lot of time stirring the leaves of this tank, very much like you would do with uh, like a Chardonnay, a batonnage, stir a barrel with a baton. Well, we stir these stainless steel tanks with a pump. And what starts off as very lean and very acid driven becomes very rich and round um, and so while it enters with that bright acidity it leaves in a, with a very very clean and pleasant sort of texture uh, and it's a wonderful match with all kinds of different types of cuisine and cuisine cuisine look at me you know I love to eat <laughs> I, obviously this one is so refreshing and nice it's a great way to start the day or the evening but with food, what are we going to eat tonight? Well, I like steamer clams with this with this particular wine. Uh, this is something that my boss taught me how to do. We make uh, our own pasta at home, and then uh, it's very simple preparation with garlic and fennel, a little pepper, and some rice, white wine, and some white wine. Well, Anna Valley Vineyards Pinot Gris might work. It's always <laughs> great to cook with the wine that you're drinking. Um, but uh, yes, absolutely. Or or perhaps oysters. Uh, you know, raw cooked Rockefeller. Any any way you can get oysters. This wine texturally works so well with oysters and it is so clean on the palate it's uh it's really a, a great pairing oh. 2009 willamette valley vineyards pinot gris now that's the good life <laughs>